How's it going, YouTubers? The Electron Man. I got a little, uh, one of those inexpensive items you can pick up of uh, Amazon or eBay uh, for a really reasonable price reviews. Um, I wouldn't call it cheap items, but uh, but nifty tech items for under $20, say. Uh, but anyway, this is, uh, today we're going to do a uh, review over these GoSund. I guess that's how you pronounce it. G-O-S-U-N-D. GoSund. GoSund. Um, I've already got a couple of these, and I ordered another two-pack. Man, these things are freaking cool. I don't know if you remember back, uh, uh, probably telling my age, but probably like 10 years ago, they had those X-10s, you know, where you could turn off lights and, you know, in the house and turn on fans, etc. And you buy these X-10 modules. Well, this kind of is the same thing, except for this runs off of uh, off your Wi-Fi network in your house and uh, your phone. And uh, these things are, are amazing. Um, I, I use them all over... Uh, Turn lights on and off, uh, turn fans on and off, um, uh, you know, like if I'm going to be home late and I want to make sure uh, that, uh, that I don't want to drive up dark into a dark house, I can turn on the, the front lamp in my living room. Um, I, I just, I find them really cool. They're, uh, I think they're rated at like 15 amps. So, you know, you can run a, you can run quite a bit of stuff on them. I wouldn't be running a, a heater or a, a high load refrigerator, or, you know, a high load start motor, but, uh, for light bulbs, uh, um, and I'll show you a little bit on the app here. Uh, I mean, yeah. But anyway, basically, here's the unboxing here. There's two of them in here. I ordered a two pack this time, but uh, I'll take these little protective things off. Basically, what you do is is uh, you take them, and uh, there's a uh, there's a barcode on the side that you can scan with your phone that'll get you the app. I've already got the app on my phone, but. Uh, Basically, you take that, you plug this into a, uh, a wall socket. In fact, I, I guess I could show you that. Let me, uh, I, I hate, I don't have a tripod, so I don't want the camera to bounce around too much. So I'll kind of uh, go through it first here, and then I'll plug it in and see if I can uh, kind of show you how it goes there. But, but basically, uh, you plug it into the wall, and then you hold this button down until you get a slow blink. When you get a slow blink, then you uh, load it on your phone app, tell which one of the little devices that you have. It'll detect it, and then from there you can uh, configure it. And, uh, and it, the app's called Smart Life on these. Um, I do know one thing: if you're gonna buy these, buy one brand. I brought a couple other brands, and uh, you, they work just as good. But I like the idea that I have all my modules in one app, so I don't have to open multiple apps. Which is kind of why I bought two more of these because I bought another one from a from a different brand, I had it on sale or something, and they ended up having to load another app. So then I've got two apps on my phone. To control the lights but they're great for controlling fans exhaust fans uh lights i mean just basically anything that you want to uh to control in your house um with your phone i mean it, it's it's a it's basically a remote control uh light switch is what it is um and it's also got some cool things on the app as far as you can have schedules um like uh say you're uh you uh i don't you got some some area that you want to that you want to uh to cool off or, or, or you know, uh, or heat up even for that. I, I would limit it to 15 amps. Let me check on that. I think it's 15 amps, which that means you could run a little space heater or whatever if you wanted to uh, off of one. But anyway, point being is, is you can either remotely do it or you can even set it up on a schedule. You know, you could tell it, uh, if you know, uh, you want a room to, be, to warm up a little bit or, or cool off or you want the fan on to, to clear the air before you get there. You know, you can set a schedule. Uh, you know, you're getting home at, at 6. You can tell it to come on at 530. Um, but but it's cool. You can actually set a measure. Uh, let's see what is the specs on this. Um, I'm trying to see what the amperage is on it. I believe they're 15 amps, but uh, not 10 amp, 10 amp max. So uh, they have they have higher current ones. If you were wanting to do like an air conditioner or something, which it would really be cool for that too. Um, I actually, you know, of course, I got a I got a in my home. I've got a thermostat, so that that would be a different deal. But but say you had a window unit or something that you wanted to turn on a. Uh, you could definitely use one of these. I'd go with the higher current. This is a 10 amp, a uh, little, you know, 5,000 BTU. You'd probably be fine on it, but I wouldn't put a big air conditioner. But anyway, the point being is, is you know, uh, automate your house. This is super cool, and uh, I've got them set up on my lamps in my living room. One of my yard lights or my outside light by my pool. I've got it set up on there. Um, got it set up on a couple different fans. Um, just a cool little uh, automation item and I mean they're they're cheap they're uh, I think I got two of these for like $15 um, I'll go ahead and go through a quick setup with you on it and show you 
show you. Anyway, I'm not going to get into real detail because it's not real hard and it's got instructions with it, but I'll kind of show you what you got to do as far as get one going here. Hold on, let me stop this and. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and plug it into the socket here. Like that. And if you watch on the side here, you're going to you're gonna notice that light's going to come on. And see how it's fast blinking right now? What you want to do is you want to hold it down. I heard it click, and it should start to go to a slow blink now. See how it's in a slow blink now? Now all you got to do is just load the app on your phone. And then, uh, let me see here. I just crystal press on. I want to add one to it. And then I'm just going to be, it's going to be a socket Wi-Fi. And then you'll want to give your password for your Wi-Fi, which I've already got the app on her, so it already has them in there. And you click next. And then you click next. It says power on the device, okay. Okay, I got the indicator blinking slow. Click next. Okay, it now detected it. Uh, the light went off on it, and as you can see, it says Mini Smart Plug 2 device has been added successfully. So I've now added it to my phone. So now then I can click on this device here. Well, actually, click down. And uh, it says the socket's off. And uh, we'll see if I turn it on. See how it turns red on that deal? And turn it off. See, so now I have control of that docket, um, of that uh, socket now, and I can plug whatever device I want into it. Um, coffee pot. Uh, I mean, I could, you know, the the it's endless. Basically, if you want to automate your house for a really reasonable price, uh, get six or seven of these and uh, and download the phone app, and, and boom, you're up and running as far as. Like I said, it's got really cool. So it's got a timer. You can set it to where. Uh, Say you want the lamp to go off 30 minutes after you go to sleep. You can set the timer here and it has a countdown timer. You can uh, set it for one hour, you know, whatever, and uh, confirm and set the timer back. I try to do this one-handed. Uh, you also got the capability of a scheduler, which uh, you basically, like I said, you can Monday through Friday, Monday seven days a week. It gives you all the options when it comes on, when it turns off, so you can schedule it. And of course, you always have the uh, ability just to open the switch up and just turn it on turn it off when you want anyway I just these are cool items I've been using the heck out of them uh, I've got six or seven around the house now and uh, and I really like them and you know if you like the X10s you'll love these uh, much simpler this little simple phone app uh, just follow the instructions like I did and just pair it up and uh, you're up and running anyway like I said, this is a little short review today I hope you enjoyed this like I said I'm kind of trying to go over these uh, these uh, these are all just basically kind of, I don't know what you call them, reasonable tech items that you can find reviews. But anyway, uh, I'm rambling on now. Everybody have a great day. I did have a reader ask me if I'm going to do like daily videos, and that is not the intention. But uh, I did uh, set myself a goal for this year to uh, to produce, uh, I'm not even going to say the amount, but I definitely want to, uh, you know, produce a lot more videos this year. Uh, definitely, I'd like to at least produce 100-bit videos this year this year you know it'd be one like every three days or four days so i uh, definitely look forward to more videos from me this year uh you know i, I kind of told y'all to pursue this and um, see if i can if i can make a go of it anyway everybody out there have a great day this is electron man please like and subscribe